Hi, uh, this is Alcan PLC controller. On this video, we're gonna show you how to change the uh, pressure settings and some other settings as well. <laughs> Basically, the top here that we see, P00, that, that's the page zero. The page zero is the information page. If you go in page zero, you will see the control mode, compressors, now it's an automatic mode, which means that it will automatic shut off and automatic start. Uh, if you make this control mode manual, it would still automatically shut off, but it wouldn't automatically start. You have to press on start button to start the compressor. The next one is the time, it's showing the current time, the date, uh, daylight saving, equipment out pressure zero, the stage pressures, first, second, and third stage pressures. You see the oil pressure here, and the, the temperature, air temperature, coming out from the compressor. To change the pressure setting, first we need to go to uh, page nine. But let's go on the pages one by one. Page, page zero one is the service times. Basically, it's showing you the service times. What are the service times are? The first one is total hours. It's, these numbers are uh, counting down. For example, load, offload hours as two hours. Compressor right now uh, was uh, used only two hours. Load hours, compressor you worked under the load two hours. Offload hours, zero. Stopped hours, purifier, filter hours. Right now it's showing uh, 1,998 hours. Basically it's counting down from that. If you change the purifier filter on 80 hours, you have to set this number to 80. So it starts counting down and it will give you the alert. Uh, the valve service, it's counting down from 2000. Oil service counting down from 500. If you go to page two, page two is the utilization page. This is just the informational page again, showing you offload hours. Uh, some other informational uh, no inf informational page. If you go to page three, these are the error logs. Page four is the event log. Page five is the just showing the Alcan compressor, our email and stuff. Controller data. Page six, equipment data, and the page nine is the users. In order to change the settings and pressure, cutoff pressure and start pressure, you have to log in as admin. So I'm gonna go in page nine. I will go to admin user and I press on enter. It's gonna ask you a password. Password is gonna be provided you by the manufacturer. Now you see the active users is the admin. If you go in admin user and click on enter again, you can change the admin settings as well. For example, you can change the pin, you can change the language, you can change the time format. I'm gonna change that to 12 AP. And date time, I'll bring the month first. The pressure unit, I'll make the, this PSI. Temperature, Fahrenheit, and now I can get out from page nine. I, my, my active user is admin and I go on page 10. On page 10, you can now change the on and off pressure. For example, load pressure right now is 4,400 PSI. You can click on it and you can bring it down to whatever you want. We recommend minimum 10% difference between the load pressure and offload pressure. So you need to take that under consideration. We don't want compressor to start stop too frequently. And the offload pressure now is 5,000. On this machine, you can maximum you can do 5,000, so don't go beyond that. And now, this is how we change the pressure settings. If you wanted to change the pressure, uh, the, for example, service times, like a purifier, you, here I go to page, 40 in the page 40 I see purifier filter time now I can bring it down to 80 for example and it will start from 80 and it will start counting down from 80 one once it's 
the, the time is zero or and it's the screen's gonna start giving you an alert. So I'll make this 80. Or how, how often you want to change the purifier filter, you can set that hours here. I'll do that. For example, I'm gonna do that 60 on this. Okay. The oil service is counting down from 500, so that's okay. Valve service counting down from 2000, I will leave them as is. And page 41 is also, when I, once I change the purifier hours, it's also changed to 60 here seamlessly. So right now I, I changed the pr pressure setting and the, the purifier filter time. This is how you uh, make changes on this uh, PLC controller.